Well, hello everyone, and welcome after a very long time, though not very long time, maybe about a week and a half, two weeks, back to Minecraft. And uh, this is how Incendio is coming. Yeah, I'm very excited about this. Uh, I've been, as you know, I've been gone for just over a week from Minecraft in the Vox Box and have been playing Monster Hunter Frontier. And we have had those several nice videos from that, and that will continue uh, along with these vids. I will be trying to do more Minecraft videos in the future. Uh, I know a lot of you subscribe for these, and so I need to get this out. But yeah, so I came, I got on, and um, a lot of it was how I remember it. And then all of a sudden, there's a lot of stuff that wasn't how I remembered it, and it's awesome. So let's, let's start, um, let's kind of show off the whole town, as much as can be seen. Uh, since I last showed it, um, last, last time I showed it, we had like these statues, like that, some small things. But yeah, so the wall is basically completed. We have one more section, probably going to go right here along to the beach house here where we have the mouth of dragon which um, is actually a leviathan, it's not actually a dragon but it's, it's been named inappropriately on purpose kind of strange but uh, it has its nest on top of it and the math, uh, the mathy family uh, has been guarding the egg for since the city's founding uh, which was actually quite a long time ago I'm surprised that the building hadn't burned down the number of times the city's been burned uh, oh that's all lore and stuff like that though uh, so no, this actually needs a road going to it, but here's some, there's that other building Matthew built originally. We'll see in here. This is the one you guys have seen before, along with the guild hall, which I also been pasted in. And we also have a lot of new stuff. The roads have been mostly completed going through the town. We have the map shop here, the armory, which Viral did a great job on. Look at it. Look at this thing. This is amazing. This epic painting here. I don't want to hit it because it'll fall off the wall though. And then, of course, this small little tiny employee room full of stock and stuff. All these shelves that will be filled with weapons and such. And these doors that make it a little more hard, difficult to get out, but it's not a big deal. Up here, of course, we have Molostra and the, and the small little hunting ship going after it. I need to build more of these or copy paste them in or whatnot just to make it look a little, a little more realistic. Of course, the guild hall here, uh, some random housing, stuff like that. Over here we have a restaurant, which needs a, also needs a road. And um, it's a little bit bright, a little bit pink. Might have that change. Probably going to go in and do a color swap on this purple carpet and this pink here. I'm not quite digging it. So yeah, um, still still cool nonetheless. The, we've got another nice restaurant over here. Needs some doors though. It also needs a bigger interior because it's also kind of not full. I'll probably put some table stuff in here. Has different kinds of foods you would only find. Um, let me hit the button. There we go. It also appears. To, oh, there it goes. So we got some well done steak there with some pork chops. I think is what that is actually. Yeah, that's pork chop. All right, we'll head out. Over here's the docks. And they're going to be some fishing ships, hunting a little bit bigger monsters than you'd expect fishing ships to be hunting. Not quite Melostra size and not quite Dravian size, but yeah, still fairly large than most all of Lithans, large fish monsters, and such. Now over here we have Rose Dragon's house, which isn't quite completed yet, so I won't go inside there. I'll let her. And then we have these epic trees, which I'm going to have built all across the city um, and a little bit around it. And I have no idea who built these. I would assume Rose Dragon built them, but if that's not the case, someone can gladly. Correct me on that. But yeah, um, I really do like these trees. I got on and like freaked out when these were here because these are epic and they fit the city's theme perfectly. Yeah, so I'm, I'm most excited about that. And another thing we have is, as we're working on the walls, we have these ballista points. This one's actually firing on the Dravian. And the city is currently under a small attack. This is a um, an anti Leviathan weapon. Of course, the the pilot would sit here. It's controls, and then we've got two guys who would man one here and one here, which would turn these, which would which actually moves this large spear, which um these chunks aren't loading, so I'm probably gonna get kicked in a minute. Um, yeah, I'm gonna kick in a minute. But yeah, so we'll finish up the tour right here. Um, yeah, all these anti -we monster weapons. But yeah, I hope you really enjoyed this tour of Incendio. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and thanks for watching. This is Gravion, signing out.